Can we please play the game? I'm yes. sweating. Who wants to play? Two truths and a lie. Anybody want to play? Let's play. Let's play. Here's how it works. Blair is going to tell us three things about himself. Two true, one of them is a lie, and all of us get to guess which one is the lie. And we're going to guess two because we don't know. So away know? we go. No, no. you're going to tell all us right, the three things. So go ahead. All right. Take it away, Blair. Number one. Reading. During college, I spent my long, hot summers entertaining oh, tourists, <laughs> singing and dancing in the hats off the Hollywood Review at Bush Gardens. All right. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> this year I traced my family roots and found out what I've always thought was true. Carrie Underwood is my distant cousin. <laughs> it could happen. I haven't taken home an Oscar yet. <laughs> but, <laughs> but on my mantle I do have the music industry's most coveted award, a Grammy. <laughs> I, should have, I should have sung that one. All right, All right guys. Audience. What do you think? Is one, it, two, three. Is it one, Bush Gardens that he performed in the summers? Two, Carrie Underwood's cousin, perhaps. And number three, is Blair a Grammy winner? Hold up your fingers. Story number one, two, or three. Well, and since holding up your fingers one, isn't necessarily one, good to you. Okay, clap for one. Clap for one. Clap for one. Okay, that's Bush Gardens. Clap for two, Carrie Underwood. Clap for three, the other one. The Grammy one. I think we I think the audience I mean, I is think going it's with Carrie Underwood, right? I, the I'm Carrie's going the with Bush Gardens, because if I'd known you were performing, I would have been there. Alright, so Larry has that as the lie. Okay. Audience has the Carrie Underwood as a lie. I'm a smart man. I think this is the smartest audience I may have ever seen in the history of television. I too am going. Ah. Alright, boss. Do you and tell? The, and the, the lie is. is Carrie actually is not my cousin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I knew that. By you knew that. You I just didn't want to be like so all compatible with everybody. <laughs> hey, everybody, check out. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, I would explain the truth. Tell me about Bush Gardens. I want to know. Do we have time? I'm yeah, so yeah. happy. Yeah, yeah. Well, quickly, yeah, yeah. So I performed at Bush Gardens uh, in between college, uh, my freshman and sophomore year, and I was very honored and am very honored to have won the uh, Best Spoken Word album in 2008 with Cynthia Nixon from Sex and the City yeah, yeah. and Bo Bridges. We, we narrated, I didn't sing, trust me, you don't want that. But I feel like you could. But we, oh, thank you. We narrated uh, Al Gore's An Inconvenient Truth. Cool. So how, like, and how is that uh, for an actor? Just using the voice, just using that one instrument, what's it oh, like? Oh, it's the best. I mean, you don't have to worry about wardrobe or hair and makeup, kind of come in, roll out of bed <laughs> and sweats and, and, just, and just talk and kind of use your, your, your vocal instrument. Uh -huh. so just, no, just sweats. It's I'm sorry, sure I'm just so. staring at exactly. you. Exactly. And that's okay. I'm okay with it. <laughs> I'm okay with it. I'm going to bring back uh, Lara. Meanwhile, won't you uh, help me thank this fella? It's a streetcar named the yeah.